This is our 2006 uh, Range Rover HSE Luxury and Cold Weather Package. We're down here in Fife looking at a new Range Rover for ourselves. And this is, uh, if I take a little video real quick, the people on Craigslist looking at our ad. Uh, this has uh, Cooper uh, tires on it. These are the um, Discoverer AT3s. And uh, as you can see here, they are at 265. 65 R18. Uh, they are 18 inch LR3 wheels, the same uh, offset or within two millimeters, and uh, just a little bit bigger than normal. And the normal over the normal uh, outside diameter is 30 and a half inches. These are 31 and a half inches, so just a little bigger. No rubbing at all, even when you're at full lock. Uh, not even in low mode. Um, they, if you ever happen to lose air suspension and drop on the bump stops. It's a little bit rougher of a ride, but it's already a rough ride. And if you got that problem, uh, it's going to be a long ways on the road because the suspension system is working great and we had the uh, front one replaced that had a problem. Anyway, uh, turn the signals on. Turn on the hazards. Anyway, we just uh, got new LEDs um, for the... Uh, uh, driving lights up there. That'll be those guys right there. It looks like it's flickering, but it's not flickering. It's just how the video resolution works, I assure you. Uh, just one of those things the video can't capture like the eye can. Um, anyway, there's uh, almost no blemishes on the vehicle. Uh, the one, you might be able to see it right there in the middle of the screen, right smack dab in the middle of the passenger door. Uh, that was from a parking sign. Uh, down there at uh, on Queen Anne Avenue. It's really not even through the paint. It's just kind of annoying. Uh, full tint, as you can see, it's pretty dark. Uh, not for everybody, maybe, but uh, the tint on the front window is actually very mild um, when you look out of it. When you look out the tint there, you can barely even tell it's tinted at all. Hey, Buster. And uh, anyway, looking through, it's a really good tint job done by AccuTint in Seattle and uh, just makes it look a little bit nicer and certainly keeps the heat and the uh, glare down in the summertime and privacy too. Anyway, it runs great, everything works on it, uh, except for the backup camera, um, which is about $550 to $600, including labor to replace. We've, uh, it's never worked since the day we bought it two years ago, so that's just kind of one of those things uh, we didn't care about, and if you do, it's not that big of a deal to replace. We just haven't opted for it. We've put all of our money into maintaining it, having all the fluids replaced, uh, that sort of thing. So, anyway, it's uh, 2006. This is the Jaguar 4.4 liter. That's Buster. And uh, it's got the green interior. Um, sorry, it's a little dirty right now. I haven't cleaned it in a little bit, but... Uh, Got some LEDs uh, everywhere. There are LEDs um, that can be put in. I replaced them with the, from the halogen ones so that they're a little brighter and whiter. And generally speaking, it's a really good, clean, fun uh, vehicle. Anyway, if you have any questions, uh, send me a message. Thanks.